All right, we'd like to talk a little bit about the uh, new uh, client for SNOM1. Actually, this is using standard CST CSTA commands, and it adds some new functionality to, uh, to um, SNOM1 providing a Windows-based client. All right, so what we have here is a client. You can uh, dial simple numbers. Just dial a number in there, hit enter. You have one new and message. We'll dial. message number one. Um, it also um, allows you to set the do not disturb status of your phone. So you can uh, set your do not disturb. And if you'll notice, uh, of course, in the client, in the list there you'll see that that 101 is on do not disturb and if we go over here and take a look you'll notice that automatically I didn't touch the phone also set the phone on do not disturb so we could press the do not disturb on the phone and it will okay so do not phone went off and if we look over here on the client it's so you can you can change your do not disturb from both places um, also, another thing we've decided to do for people that are using something like Office 365, we also made it so that if you set the presence in, off in Link or Office uh, Communicator, it will also change it on the, the SNOM1 client and it will also change it on the phone. So you can change the change your do not disturb disturb status from the place that uh, suits you or you can select to do it on the one that suits you and as we turn it back it also switches back all right so um, what are some other things it gives easy access to features that otherwise you have to remember star key so you can right click and do something like well let's just do an intercom and there it did a, a successful intercom over to another phone. Um, but you also have access to all those features. Um, things like call their voicemail directly, call their mobile phone, intercom, do a directed call pickup. And, and all of these are based on uh, SNOM1 uh, security. So you can listen in, whisper in, barge, and uh, as soon as we have instant mes message capability, we could implement uh, shared desktop. We have all the code. We're just waiting on uh, SNOM1 CSTA so that we can uh, get the, that. You can also start an email to that person. Automatically, we'll trigger an email based on that contact. Um, and of course, you can add a contact. And this contact can be it can be a, an extension to the system or just some other number you want to call. For example, down at the bottom here we have tell me. So we can get that. And that's just a, just a, a contact that you can, or a quick dial, you might say. And you can tell the difference between quick dials and extensions. Extensions in PBX will have green, the other ones will be yellow. Um, Another thing that we did is we made it so, this might show better just by demonstrating it. So let's say you're on a website and you want to copy it and you know they have all kinds of formatting uh, and uh, so on and so forth. And you copy and paste in here to dial and you hit dial. And you heard it dialed it. So how did it do that? Well, what we do is we clean that up for you. Get rid of the junk, we decode the alpha, the letters into numbers and, and do that work for you. Okay, what else do we have in here? Um, oh, another thing we have for those who maybe would be like an Office 365 user, you can run this in tray mode only. So let's go down here, right click, go to hide. So you can start this in hide or hidden mode so you don't have any client on your desktop but you still have the tray. 
I can right click everything I could do before. For example, I could I could type in there one eight hundred five 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 tell, and that will work just the same. And of course, you have your presence. You can set it from here. Also, get your voicemail. Once again, you can turn it back on. Um, so, just some of the features that we are, of um, course, up here. You can click to get your voicemail. Add one new message. Message number. And the little orange indicator there is only lit. It's a message waiting indicator that comes on when you have voicemail. All right, and we are, um, while this is made, uh, this client is made for SNOM 1, it is using, uh, it is using standard CSTA, so it will actually work with anything, any, any PBX that is st using standard CTA, uh, CSTA. All right, um, we also um, made it so that we can brand it. Uh, there is help, that is, those links can be customized, the icon, the name of the product can be changed for hosted uh, uh, PBX providers as well. All right, just wanted to show you a little bit what we're doing. Uh, there's a lot more to come, continues to be more. Um, we'd like to have uh, whether a show whether somebody's on a call or not as well. Um, it already, oh, I don't know if I showed that, but it does, okay, so. I see is 176 on there. Well, maybe I didn't show it before, but um, if somebody, if anybody puts their phone on busy or do not disturb, it will turn to do not disturb. So that's my own extension, but it works for other people as well. All right, um, uh, the SNOM1 client, just a little overview. Thank you.